just that kind of week. Yesterday, <laughs> we had the Cirque du Soleil performers with us. Today, we have a few of our friends to celebrate National Clown Week. But uh, first, we want to talk about something that's going on in Camden County right yeah, now. Yeah, so the Vector Rocket test launch is going to happen around 1140. News for Jacks will be live streaming it. So go to your PC, go to your phone, and definitely check that out because it's locally here. Uh, it's Spaceport Camden in Waverly, Georgia. And it's always fun to watch whenever they do these type of test launches, if you will, because you never know what's going to happen. So it's something you might want to check out. We really do. We have something for everybody today as far as our show. I would like to take yeah. <laughs> I'll say, I'll say. So, so getting back to our guests, we have Skittles, that's the clown, and Sprinkles, the clown. The is clown. everybody the clown? We... Just, yeah, it's worth it family. Our last name is Clown. Okay. <laughs> That's a so, title. Man. You earned the right, right? I understand. Like doctor. I understand our friend Mayor Lenny Curry has proclaimed the week. So that's yes. exciting. It is it is exciting. Actually, uh, National Clown Week was um, declared by President Nixon in 1971. Hmm. So who knew? It's been going on for years, and I didn't know until five, six years ago. Yeah, oh, wow. So, and now it's grown into an international, it's recognized internationally, so clowns all over the world are celebrating National Clown Day. A week. A <laughs> week? <laughs> Wait, what? but Mayor you... Curry hooked you up with his special day with a proclamation, correct? That's absolutely correct. This afternoon, we get to meet with Mayor Curry, and he officially presents us with the proclamation he mailed it to me a couple weeks ago. <laughs> <laughs> you got it in black and white. That's yeah. good news. Yeah. Okay, so let's talk about being a clown and what you love about it. I mean, obviously, some people have it and some don't, and I know <laughs> you guys do. What's the best part? Uh, just seeing the smiles on children's faces, mm -hmm. making children, and adults, too. Um, but I just want to give props to Sprinkles here. She's the El Presidente of Gator Clowns, and she's mm -hmm. done an awesome job getting ready for Clown Day, which we're going to talk about, which is Saturday. That's right. So well, let's talk let's about let's it. Let's talk about it. Okay. Well, this year, in years past, we have gone to um, public locations like um, uh, the Landing, Riverside Arts Market. This year, we're partnering with the Arlington Family Y on Atlantic Boulevard, and we're really trying to make it as much about them as possible because this is going to be a fundraiser for that location. And um, so we're going to be there Saturday from 10 to 2 where uh, we'll have two shows. We're going to do face painting. We're going to do balloon twisting. We have um, five children who have been taken from summer camp and given special rec recognition. So we have some surprises in store for them. Um, they're going to be selling hot dogs and chips and cakes and muffins and all kinds of So this is a great stuff. family event. So it's I a think wonderful family event. Next year, I want to get dressed up for Clown Day. Can you take me to Clown School? I can. Clown School is in August and you'd be, no, it's not. It's in April. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, tick tock. Come on. We'll so, talk about that. But come so, Saturday and we can make you a clown for a day. We're okay. having a little bit. There you go. Right. There you go. Yeah. We're going to teach juggling. We're going to teach some balloon twisting for the those who are interested, it's awesome. going to be much fun. And we're going to make sure that everybody knows about this by posting all about Gator Clowns and the event on RiverCityLiveTV.com. Let's dive right